How about it, guys? Big Bruce here, Diecast Gypsy. So we're in Phantom Canyon in Colorado. This was an absolutely beautiful trail. I like to take detours when we're traveling. You never know what kind of adventures you're going to get into. This is on the backside of Pikes Peak. A little glare on the dashboard, a little shaky here and there. Man, we did the best we could. Uh, you know, always call. Cool. Guys, enjoy it, man. This is only supposed to be an hour-long trip. We didn't spend like three hours or better filming and driving down through here and just enjoying the scenery. Lots of different changes in elevation. Hopefully, you guys enjoy. So keep in mind, we're on the backside of Pikes Peak. <laughs> we weren't going to climb mountains today, but we ended up climbing mountains after all. This has been spectacular. Our first switch back. Lots of fun little valley. So yeah. We've seen some other cars coming head on. A few, a few rigs. Lots of fun. The video, of course, does not do it justice, man. This is actually a pretty good sized drop off. This is really just the beginning of the uh, the higher uh, elevations of the trail, and it's through this amazing canyon. And if you listen real close, you can hear Jim's butt just tighten right up. Bet you couldn't get a pin in that thing. Sheer drop off to the side, not much room. And occasionally, we did come across some cars here and there. Absolutely spectacular, man. If you ever get a chance to go for this run, I definitely suggest it. Okay, guys, some of the audio on here, of course, is really, really crappy. But when I was setting the point of interest to help us kind of find this trail in the first place, because we just accidentally ran across Phantom Canyon, period, uh, there was a spot called Cow Mountain. And, uh, well, we figured out why they call it Cow Mountain. Right here it is. Uh, just cows wandering around, free grazing and stuff. Not a lot of places in America left that you can run across little spots like this. But it's pretty cool. Oh, there's another, there's a truck coming there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Excuse me. Excuse me, steak. Cheeseburger. Country rib. Guys, I got proof that there's been monkeys running the uh, world once before. We found monkey rock. It looks like a monkey screaming. Pretty cool. Planet of the Apes. So along the way, we found these great little colorful magnet rocks that somebody had left out on the trail. So we took a couple for the kids to bring back home, and we left something in return. Actually, somebody contacted us that found some of these, and uh, hope you hopefully you enjoy the cars, and hopefully you left something behind. Just something else fun. So pretty much all the way through these trails, man, we just oh, wow. wowed and talked about how beautiful it was all the way through, man. And just, I'm talking about hundreds and hundreds of feet of sheer just cliff face and canyons, lots of rock slide spots and stuff. We didn't get enough video footage to really do this place justice, man. But just absolutely spectacular. You know, take a side road, man. Enjoy yourself. Don't be in such a rush to get somewhere if you can. You never know what kind of beautiful adventure that you might get into. This is something we'll remember for the rest of our lives. Absolutely spectacular. Loving it.
look how beautiful it all is. This is the prettiest part yet. Yeah. That's okay. So as we're traveling through, we come across several bridges, man. Uh, a lot of them are old wood plank bridges, and they are just absolutely spectacular. This used to be a trail for a train to run through for the gold mining towns. This is actually part of the gold belt in the middle of Colorado. Uh, look up Phantom Canyon, man. We put a little bit of information there at the beginning of the video, but it's a uh, pretty spectacular. This pass goes from down in Killer Creek all the way back up to Victor, Colorado. And that is the video actually that uh, we actually produced before this. So this is one of the wooden plank bridges that came up, uh, one of the bigger ones. There's a real big one towards the end, but you can actually hear the sound of the bridge now. Real heavy winds coming through the canyon too, and actually we, uh, we come up ahead from right here, and luckily there was a little pull off there to the side. And also, we had a storm that we could watch coming up over the mountains behind us. So we're trying to outrun the storm because we don't really run this kind of elevation. And with those kind of drop-offs beside us, it's kind of hard to tell. Hey but guys, there's probably a two or three time. thousand foot drop right beside us, <laughs> uh, all the way down to the floor. And I don't know about you, but my view. Cadillac Escalade sitting on 22s wasn't exactly built for this. Though we're building it to, to do more and more adventures. Uh, we didn't want to take a chance on sliding off this place because every once in a we would come across a spot that had a. Uh, some crosses where some lives have been lost. This is considered a very dangerous trail. Okay, guys. Check this out. Rain's catching up with us a little bit. Let's see if we can't miss that. trains down through here pretty freaking awesome Sorry guys, there was some more footage from up on top of one of the other passes, but I uh, kind of ran out of space and stopped for a few minutes, and I uh, cleared up some space. Go on Instagram and check us out on there, guys. I, I post videos on there a lot, too. At this point, we're starting to come down in elevation through the canyon, and when you land, you land almost in the high deserts uh, in Colorado. It turns into beautiful reds and stuff, just really, really spectacular. And unfortunately, we did lose some really hey great guys, video footage. Uh, man, I don't know how we managed to do it. I was trying to clear up some space, and I guess I accidentally dumped a couple of files. We've been working our way south. out here for probably about two hours now. Absolutely fantastic though. We've had a blast. We gotta be getting towards the end somewhere. It's starting to rain a little bit. We're definitely getting down in the lower stuff. It turned a little deserty down here.
wait for the bandits to pop, pop up along the edge of the cliffs and stuff. Enjoy doing the pass with us, man. Phantom Pass, or whatever it's called. <laughs> Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Check out uh, the Instagram page. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And as always, take it easy. So that's it for Phantom Canyon, guys. Check out the next video. As always, thank you for watching. Leave those comments below. We always appreciate it. Check out the Instagram page, the new Facebook page, also. And as always, hit that subscribe button and take it easy.